Hello from Mrs. Rania Safadi, English for Palestine, 10th grade. What happened to your arm, honey? I broke it while I was playing football. What is this black picture with you? It's an X-ray. Do you know who discovered the X-ray? If you want to know, open your books page. 74, Unit 6, Period 1. Let's start with the new vocabulary. Don't forget to use HP Reveal application. Unit 6, Period 1, Activity 1. Abroad. Dream. Give up. Graduate. Laboratory. Law. Radiation. Treat. University. War. X-ray. Now, let's know more about the discovery of radiation. Period 1. Activity 3. A scientist for the world. Maria Sklodowska was born in Warsaw in 1867. She was an excellent student at school, but it was against the law for women to go on to university. The only way was to study abroad, but her family could not afford this. She therefore worked for several years to save enough and in 1891, at the age of 24, she finally started studying at the Sorbonne in Paris. While she was studying, she was always poor and hungry. However, she worked hard and she graduated successfully three years later. When she was looking for a laboratory to continue her work that year, she met another scientist, Pierre Curie, and he invited her to use his. They soon found that they had the same dream, to make the world a better place through science. They married in 1895 and had their first child, Irena, in 1897. This happened while Maria, now Mary, was exploring the exciting new science of radiation. Pierre stopped his own research to work with her and, just a year later, they reported some important new discoveries. Then they began using radiation to treat various diseases and soon this was saving lives. In 1903, they received the Nobel Prize. However, disaster followed in 1906, when Pierre died in a terrible road accident. Marie was left to continue their work alone. She was often depressed and sick, but she did not give up. In 1911, she even received another Nobel Prize. 
When the First World War started in 1914, Mary, with her young scientist daughter, Irena, supplied over 200 X-ray machines and trained many doctors to use them to examine people's injuries. By the 1920s, she was famous, but she was also becoming very sick, almost certainly because of her dangerous work. Sadly, she died in 1934 and did not live to see Arena and husband Frédéric Joliot Curie win their own Nobel Prize in 1935. If you understand now, let's do the quiz. You will find the quiz link in the description box. I hope you enjoy. Thank you for watching and see you next video.